so in today's video we're going to talk about the most important thing you need to do just after getting your new laptop or if you're going to let's say reinstall windows and you're trying to make your old laptop fast again or you just want to restore windows with the general license so let's get started the most important thing that we all forget right after getting our new laptop because we had too busy getting our hands on it and trying all the new cool features is that we forget what happens if there is an issue with the laptop let's say you you got a windows crash or you just lost all your drivers or maybe you just want to make it the way it was well the way you received it could be a virus issue or maybe you just want to make it faster so what happens in this case is you need to have, of course, the windows and all the drivers. Now, more and more laptops, they don't ship the old school DVD drives and you don't have one in them. And which brings us to the question, do you really have a possibility to have a recovery drive? Or is there a possibility to reinstall your windows with the general license if you don't have a recovery drive already on your machine? So in today's video, we're going to talk about this one and of course, all the necessary steps, how you can achieve this. And keep in mind, this video is not only for Lenovo Legion users. This applies to all the manufacturers out there for all the possible models. So if you just go to their website and follow the steps that I'm going to show you in this video, you will be able to do the same. Yeah, of course, uh, some of the steps will be slightly different because we're well, different service providers. But more or less, uh, the process remains the same. Before we get started, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. It means a lot. And let's start. Open any browser and type support.lenovo.com. Now click on PC. On this web page, you will have the laptop category and also the laptop model. So you need to select your model. Then it will bring you to the, this page where you can see all the details about your product. Click on detect product. Now we need to go under the category driver and software. Go to order recovery media. Click to continue bring you to another page where you will have options like this this is a four step process eligibility order customer information and confirmation when you're on this page uh, you will see your product serial number your machine type operating system version and you need to select your country and don't be afraid if you didn't see your country in this particular disk it doesn't include all of them just select where you imported the model from i recommend selecting a country that speaks english so it's easier to navigate around the windows while you were on the previous page you can also select and check your warranty status and if you have raised any servicing request you will find all the details on that page okay so now moving to the next thing which is selecting the language so you select the language now this is we are almost there so now we just need to click digital download uh, you need to select accepting terms and conditions next fill your credentials name region email address and now you need to check once again all the details you have just filled make sure you type in the correct email address because you will receive a link and also confirmation on your email so once you have checked and rechecked you can click on digital download now there is one thing you need to keep in mind and this link is valid only for 72 hours which means if you want to make a backup or a recovery drive uh, you need to be prepared with good internet and make sure you don't exceed that 72 hour deadline now let's click on digital download 
you will download a file just open your downloads folder double click to run it now it will give you two options download recovery files and create a USB recovery now keep in mind your Lenovo ID is the same ID you will be using to download your digital recovery and also to log in and download the data for the recovery creator so once you input your credentials sign in it takes some time to verify the credentials so once you check your details click on next select your folder for download location click on download but I've already downloaded the files so I'll show you what happens next so you can click on create your USB recovery select the file that you just downloaded click on next it will ask you to connect a USB drive so keep in mind you need a USB drive which is 16 gigabytes or larger so I'm just going to connect my USB drive please keep in mind if you select a slower USB type it's going to be a bit painful I recommend using a USB 3.0 or at least a decent speed USB 2.0 okay my USB is connected so you need to select again the recovery file click on next yeah it shows you your drive now you just need to click next it will say yes to create partitions now from here on it's just pressing next and yes it will take some time for recovery drive to be created so you need to be a bit patient here but yeah in five to ten minutes you will have your recovery drive ready to be used using this recovery drive you can have your operating system reinstalled with all the drivers and there is no need to activate windows thanks for watching see you in the next one